Hello, hello, hello. Unboxing. Yeah. What are you gonna do? <clears throat> this gives you the chance to live vicariously through me. Um you've probably read it. Have you read the title? Can you read? I don't know. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. Uh this is the <laughs> this is the radiohead thing. There's a rate oh god. Too much tape. There's a what's it called? Amnesia? Am, 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 I've got amnesia, I don't know, something like that. Because it's some sort of anniversary. Is it an anniversary? I don't know. I don't know. But they made they made us they 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 Tom York with his wonky eye. He came and he said, Darren, you're gonna buy this album again. Because <laughs> this is probably about the third time you've bought it. You had it on C D. Yeah. Oh. It's all gone wrong. Might be if I just used the tag. It worked that time. It actually worked. Holy Mary, Mother of God, it worked. So yeah, this is a that's it, Kid Amnesia. Kid Amnesia, look at that. Mmm. It's delicious. It's in limited edition, the red vinyl, because what they've got on that side is that, and then and then there's that. They're playing with us, folks. They're playing with us. It's it's upside down and inside out, and, and there's the spine as well. <clears throat> kind of reminds me reminds me of the Red Dead Redemption album I bought <laughs> soundtrack album. <clears throat> but yeah, this is the only reason I got it is because there's um an extra an extra disc of offcuts and things. And that's it, but. Again, I said this. I've said this before. Well, everybody knows. Back in the day, back in the day, when Kid A was first, no, hold it like that. Didn't it? You should have done it at the table. I should have done it. At the, God, this is really stiff. That's better. Family crease now. Um, back in the day, Radiohead were too afraid to release Kid A and Amnesiac as a double album because they were. Too, I was worried it was, they'd be considered as prog. Prog was a dirty word back at the turn of the millennia. It's still a dirty word now. Um, but we know that they're a, they are companion albums. Everyone knows that, musically, thematically. Everyone knows that. And they finally put them together in a thing. Oh, look. Oh, look, there's some what, art. Use that term loosely. There's some art. It's the usual stuff that Tom York and Stanley Donwood does. You know what they're like. What if you get a download code with this? Probably not. It's the usual. The usual scribble. It, it really doesn't take much to do this kind of stuff. You could do it at home. Seriously. I've touched it. I've touched the vinyl. It is indeed red. It is red vinyl. Whoa, nearly dropped it there. Nearly dropped it. I'm a cheeky monkey. I've got a list to all this. I think there is a download. It's very, very cheeky of them. I noticed this. I mean, no, nothing there either. Oh, that's a shame. Or you would have liked there would be a download code. You know. Oh, red as well. <gasps> Who'd have thought it? But yeah, this is, um, I don't know if it's half speed pressed or whatnot. I don't know. Someone said about 45 RPM, but I'm sure you'd need more vinyl for that. Oh, that won't go back in. It's that noise of it hitting the, in the, hitting the crease in the cardboard. It's the noise, noise that no, son of a bitch, there is no download code. Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that, that inspire you. I'm not a big fan of this juvenile art. It's, you know, I call it juvenilia. Juvenilia? Juvenilia? Because <laughs> it is, it's that kind of anti art stuff that they do. I'm sure people lap it up. But it's not, it doesn't please me. I don't find it particularly aesthetic. I know it kind of lends itself to the, the dystopian post apocalyptic future that Radiohead and Tom York 
you know, feed into with their imagery. The world's shit. Always has been, always will be. Unless you're a, a millionaire rock star who can jet around the world with a wonky eye. It helps, doesn't it? Anyway, that's my unboxing of Kid Amnesiac. I thought there'd be more to it. I thought there might be a booklet or something or... You know, I think that's why they want you to buy the big hardback book or the, the softback book they've got out as well. I thought it might have been at least a book. I feel a, I feel a bit disappointed. I feel a bit disappointed with that. You know, I thought there might have been there might have been a booklet or at least a download code. I mean, it's quite quite expensive. I think I might have to stop buying records. I think I'm I think I'm an idiot. No, you don't have to. Don't have to. No, you don't have to say that in the, in the... No, you don't have to say that. I'm doing you guys a favour, remember? You don't have to be that mean to me. Anyway, thanks for watching. I've been looking at um, Kid Amnesia, uh, which is uh, Kid A and Amnesiac squashed together with a third disc of stuff. So unprofessional. So unprofessional. Thanks for watching. I will probably review it, though I've done part of my review already. I'm a bit, I'm a bit, I'm a bit disappointed with this. I thought there would be a booklet. Where is the download code? Oh well. Thanks for watching. Ta-da.